Nation Nation, everybody. Portia, I'm so glad to be with you. We have Tessica Brown, also known as Gorilla Glue Girl. So we want to give a warm dish nation welcome to Tessica Brown. Hey, girl. Hey, hey. Tessica. Hey. It's so nice to have you on, Tessica. It's really nice to meet you. So, you know, uh, we know that the world is calling you Gl Gorilla Glue Girl. Is that a name you think you're planning on keeping? No. Everybody had jokes and stuff online, and it was, you know, I think it got to a point where people, you know how somebody falls, and you're like, should I laugh? And yeah. then you realize that they're hurt, and then it's like, yeah. okay, it's not even funny anymore. Yeah, that's it. Everybody thought it was a joke. We didn't realize until we found out that you couldn't get it out of your hair for a month, that it wouldn't come out in the extreme heartache you were going through is when it got real for everybody. And even Portia said on the show, she couldn't sleep because she was thinking about you nonstop and what you were going through. How traumatic was this for you? It was bad. Like, I didn't even tell my mama for like a week. I didn't tell wow. her for, Yeah, because I was, I was scared for one, because I thought she was going to, you know, slap me down here. Once we couldn't get it all, this was the reason I went to social media. I knew it was going to be some backlash, but not that much. What everybody wants to know is because when you use the Gorilla Glue, because, you know, you got gots to be glue, mm -hmm. which is for the hair. You got uh, you got Gorilla Snot, which mm -hmm. is from the hair. So I think everybody was speculating. Did you know that the Gorilla Glue, did you think that it was, you know, part of the family of Gorilla Snot? No, I used it around my house. So I'm running around the house trying to figure out something that can keep my hair in place. And when I ran past the refrigerator, I seen it. And I'm like, you know, I can spray this. When I come home, I can wash it out. It did not wash out. No, and when you realized it wasn't moving, what was your first thought? I started crying. Because, I mean, it, like, the, it didn't, it just, it, right. it didn't. We saw you when you went to Dr. Obeng, who flew you out free of charge. And we saw the video of him literally gently combing through your hair because he wanted you to keep your hair. How did you feel when this glue was out of your hair and you looked at your real hair? I can't even explain because nobody never will understand that. Just me touching my scalp. The fact I, that it's even there, yeah. Did you and cry? It's, you know, it's just a few little spots that's missing. Mm -hmm. It got some missing on here. You know, it got some missing up You still the have a beautiful head of hair, Tessa. You have. And then the back. We basically got the same haircut right now. From this entire journey, is there anything that you have learned that you want to do different, that you want to move forward and do? Yes. I'm not my hair. I'm not. If I would have just left out the house without any spray, you know, at the little flyaways, flyaway, I wouldn't be talking to y'all right now. So at this point, I'm going to embrace, you know, my, I'm going to, don't, I'm going to rock my wigs. Yeah, because I got one on the way to you. Did you get your wig from Go Naked no, yet? No, no, not yet. Okay, well, <laughs> it was yet, a holiday yet. yesterday, so you should be getting it today or tomorrow. Oh, okay, okay. But yeah, I mean, don't, don't let your hair like pretty much like I did. That's a good message that you put out. Cause I know, you know, a lot of people would think like, well, what even would make you go to the extreme to think my hair has to be this perfect. Mm -hmm. And to identify that and understand that you're not your hair, who cares about a flyaway? You're still beautiful regardless. I think that's the biggest message out of this story that I've heard you say so far. That's beautiful. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Hey, don't forget to hit us up on social media. We're on all these platforms at Dish Nation. We'll see you there.